and we are going to jump off of sports, but we're going to talk about something fun really quick, and I wanted to get Chris's opinion on it. Cheetos announced that they are making mac and cheese. I am pretty excited about this. They have three different flavors that are now available. They have Bold and Cheesy, Flamin' Hot, and Cheddar Jalapeno. I am excited about all of these. I love mac and cheese, and there is nothing cheesier as far as a chip goes on the planet than Cheetos. Right now, I'm, I'm a Golden Flake guy, you know, whatever, but, but Cheetos has the most cheese of all the chips that are out there. I love mac and cheese. So when you combine these two together, obviously I am a gigantic fan of this idea. What is your favorite type of mac and cheese, Chris? Homemade. I don't, uh, need, I don't I, need store-bought mac and cheese at all. I like baked mac and cheese. I like I like mac and cheese with burn ends. I like uh, I like brisket mac and I like all of that good stuff. I am a massive fan. I don't I don't need mac and cheese out of a box. I can understand. And I I, I, I grew get up that. I grew up poor. Okay. We had a lot of cheese in our house. We had a lot of milk in our house. We had a lot of butter in our house. We had noodles. You make your own mac and cheese. There you go. I can understand it. I can that understand box it. costs money. I know it's cheap for some people. It ain't as cheap as just having government cheese and milk and butter. No, you you are way correct on that. Way yeah. way correct on that. I, I, I grew up. I'm 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 a little high. Ma- oh, I'm not a little high maintenance. If you know me personally, I'm a, I'm a lot high maintenance. <laughs> You're I'm high, the most yeah. high maintenance person I know. Um, but uh, but yeah, when it comes to food, mac and cheese just doesn't come out of a box. We we yeah. buy the blue box crap for my kids, and I don't I don't eat that. Just, That's understandable. I'll make, I'll make my I'll make my own, or I don't eat mac and cheese. Totally fair. Totally fair. Um, I do turn my nose up on crap mac and cheese, so I will not eat this at all. Hey, Damien said, what the hell, no cheese puffs? Like, hey, I love cheese puffs. Chris, you eat cheese puffs, right? Oh, no, I eat all the chips, all the yeah. junk food that, that's like artificial flavor cheese. Yeah, it's fine. But as that's far as macaroni. mac and cheese. like It's not macaroni and cheese, though. Yeah. Uh, Matt Miller yeah. said, oh, hold on, Michael Fritz said, a pothead's dream just came true. That's 100% <laughs> true. Uh, and then Matt Miller said, if you could only eat one fast food restaurant the rest of your life, what would be the choice? Chicken filet. Chick-fil-A, huh? It's not even close either. Man, that's a that's a difficult one for me. One that's not even food. fast food. That's like a real nice restaurant. Yeah, it's like Chick-fil-A. The problem with me is that there's not a lot of options there. I don't care. I love cheeseburgers more than even a, a good chicken sandwich. Yeah, but fast food cheeseburgers just blow dick. If if you get a good Wendy's burger, then then I'm all right with that. But I don't know that Wendy's would be my my all time, you know, one fast food for the rest of it. Uh, Typhon the Greek said nothing better than government spam and bread. <laughs> I don't know about all that. Uh, Michael said what a burger all day. We don't have what a burgers around here. Yeah, but we hey we will we will they announced they're coming we to will? Memphis. Will yeah they they have Wait. announced there I I don't know where it is I'll, I'll look we don't for have the location. a location I, I'll I'll find that out I'll let everybody put on the this feed shit out in Germantown or. Collierville or somewhere. Probably, probably. Uh, An hour and a half away. The Brown Yeti said, Mac, no cheese for me. Um, And then Michael said, if it's store-bought, I'd go with shells and cheese, but nothing beats homemade mac and cheese. No, that's dead on. I I love baked mac and cheese. Yeah. Period. Uh, Michael said, the white cheddar Cheetos are the devil. Uh, And then, hey, you know what? Ty from the Greek might be right. I I like Sonic. I like Sonic a lot. I might do Sonic. Sonic for 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 a... For a fast food hamburger, it is the only fast food hamburger I think I eat. Really? Yeah. That's surprising to me. That I, I figured you might be like, well, no, 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 you're high maintenance. That, it, yeah. I'm too, I'm too high maintenance, <laughs> man. That makes if sense. If it costs a buck, I ain't buying it now. I, I grew up poor. That's I'm not a, poor anymore, damn it. There you go. There you go. Uh, Joseph said five guys didn't hit Memphis. Yeah, but that's not fast food. That's not fast food. No. You can't you can't drive through it in your car. No, you got that. They you can't gotta, throw it at you from a window. It's not it, fast. That's food. not fast food. It ain't that's the same. Go in, sit down. I you think, have to order at a counter. I think Sonic would be mine. I like Sonic. So Sonic's a really good choice. Sonic's a really Sonic's probably choice number two. Yeah. If the people of Chick Fil A ran Sonic, oh god, that'd I've be just amazing. never gotten my order wrong at Chick Fil A. That's no, that's a very valid point. Uh, Chick Fil A like, has only got you know a certain. If I didn't number have things. to pull up and park, and I could just make the loop. Hey, Typhon said, uh, five guys needs to drive through. Yeah, you're damn right about that. I'd, yeah, I'd be no, right five guys had a drive-through. We're having a different conversation. Oh, a hundred percent, hundred percent. 
Yeah. Because that's real hamburger. Whataburger hamburgers are real hamburgers, but we, we just well, don't no, have one here. Listen, I, the last time I had a Whataburger hamburger, I was like nine. All right. I, I played in. My dad lived in Texas, and I still had to go see him. There was there was one. Uh, Michael said, "No love for In and Out." We ain't got In and Out down we here. We don't have In and Out. What are you talking about? I don't even know what an In and Out I've, is. I've been to. I'll say this: um, the Shake Shack that I've been to in San Francisco and in Chicago, fantastic. Food's great, whatever. But we don't have one here, so I'm not including it. And yeah, uh, and In and Out is really good. I get it every time I go out to Cali. But like, I go out to Cali once. You know, on average, about once every two years. See, this is going to be my problem. If and when I ever go out to California again, I'm, I'm not eating fast food, man. It, the only reason I'm that I get fast food. too much of a foodie. Like, so I, I went to two fast food places the last time I went out there. Uh, one was the Shake food. Shack, and one was the Taco Bell on Pacifica Beach. And that was only because it was the grand opening of the Taco Bell, and I just wanted to see what the beach setup was like. It was really cool. I mean, they were having like a massive party, all this kind of, it was, it was a lot of fun. Obviously, you can't do that right now, COVID times. But uh, Michael said, let's be honest, seven times out of ten, fast food isn't fast. It's still faster than, uh, than trying to sit down at a, at a restaurant. You know, like I, I'll wait. You don't have to get out of your car. Yeah, it's you still never fast. You put your car in park pretty fast. <laughs> yeah, you got that. Or, right. or if you live around here and you go to the chicken filet because they, they know how to do business. Oh, yeah. I mean, they you, are. You can you ridiculous. can fight about their politics all you want. If ISIS took over Chick Fil A, I'm buying the damn chicken. Yeah, well, depending upon if ISIS ran it the same way. Well, like as it, long as it's ran the way it is and it tastes the way it is, I'm buying the chicken. <laughs> I don't care who I'm supporting. Matt, uh, Matt asked if Zaxby's is good. Um, Zaxby's is fantastic. Zaxby's yeah. is really, really good. Like there was a time when I first got Zaxby's. I stopped going to Chick Fil A for a while, and I just went to Zaxby's. Hey, I can understand it. It's, I used it's to get real, uh, real good. Uh, I used to get their what is it, boneless wings and things combo. I mean, it was fantastic. You know, you got your celery, you got your fries, you got your you know whatever. Uh, but their their wing sauces are really really good. So I'm I'm in with that. Their salads are good, or or salads or whatever they call them. Uh, Damien said Sonic is like Texas. Everything big as hell. Michael said best. Uh, best tip you will ever get, San Diego's Hodads. You ever been to Hodads in San Diego? I've only been to San Diego once. And when I go to California, I pretty much only go to San Diego. Um, Hodads, I don't, I've never heard of that. I've never heard of that either, but I will definitely do it. Joseph said, Chris is an expensive date. Who knew? And uh, <laughs> Yeah, but Chris pays for the date. So, yeah. and so that's not expensive if, if you ain't paying I'm, for it. I, I'm the one that when we go out with my family, you cover it. Check. Uh, Typhon said, Arby's. Hmm. I listen, I will tell you, my first freshman year of college, that's right. Oh, I, um, I did the same in college, I, by the way. The 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 five for five fifty five or whatever deal that they oh, used yeah. to have. Oh, oh shit. Man, I, I would the get, only way I survived. I, I used to stay like when I was going down to Bill Street basically every night, you know, every night four or five nights a week. And I'd get back sometime after midnight. Arby's was open on fifty five, you know, at, at Goodman. And I would drop by that Arby's and I would get chicken tenders and curly fries. I, I still think they got the best fries out of everybody. I've never, I've never bought anything there, but, but their cheesy roast beef sandwich. Hey, the uh, the beef and cheddar, like I, yeah. I owned that thing for a while. Yeah. Uh, Typhon said Hardee's. I'll tell you this interesting football story related to this. We used to get a Hardee's biscuit. And I'd get chicken Hardee's biscuits. Bre- Hardee's biscuit, breakfast but, is yes, top oh. notch. Yes. Like, 100%. I mean, it's Cracker Barrel good. Yes. It, so, yeah. But that's the only thing I will eat from there because their cheeseburgers, every time I got them, were awful. I don't Absolutely know that I've awful. ever had a cheeseburger from Hardee's. And you shouldn't. Don't even mess with it. Don't even mess with it. Joseph said, order every topping possible in a Sonic milkshake. Thank me later. Now, I'm good on that, bro. <laughs> I wait too much for that. I can't do that now. Um, no, I'm not, it's not about the size. I just don't want all those damn toppings at once. Oh man, and that it, it's just too sweet. Like I, I can't do sweet stuff. We talked about that with uh, with liquor before. Like I, I'm a bourbon guy or a tequila guy. I can't, I can't mix a bunch of sugar. But you're the opposite, right? Like you like the sugar. Uh, stuff. Well, when it comes to tequila, I just drink it straight. Yeah. If it's not good enough to drink straight, I don't drink it. Well, that's not true. I I'll drink shitty tequila and a margarita all day long. But yeah, I I like sweeter booze. Uh, Michael said, "Let me know when y'all are out this way." Ho dads on me, bacon cheeseburger. I'm game. I'm game. We'll Are you in San Diego? I thought he was in Sacramento. 
No, he's at Ben is in Sacramento. Michael's in uh, Bakersfield. So, oh, okay. Uh, the Brown oh, Yeti. Then, yeah. yeah, the Brown Yeti said, I think we all agree Wendy's is the best at talking trash on Twitter. Oh, 100%. No, Wendy is a fantastic Twitter follow. Yes, they most certainly are. Damien asked us, McDonald's or Burger King? I'm going to go Burger King all day. Every oh, I'm a McDonald's guy all day long. Really? Yeah. Really? It, so, this is weird. You'll, it, this is just about my price. It'll tell you a lot about me as a person. When I was younger, I'm I'm a man who... Don't necessarily believe in, I believe in a right and a wrong, but not necessarily like strict, like biblical morality. Okay. But I am a man of morals. I am a man of principles. I believe when two things are rivals, you, you must pick one and love, you love one and hate the other. I believe that. Okay. Okay. So when I was younger, I grew up a Coke guy. All right. Okay. I don't allow Pepsi products in my house. Okay. My mother-in-law drinks Pepsi. And that shit pisses me off. Once a year, she comes around. My wife stacks my fridge with it, and it bothers me. I don't like it, okay? <laughs> I, I don't even know that I can tell you what a Pepsi tastes like, but I grew up with them being the devil. I, the McDonald's and, and and Burger King. Now, the, all these other fast food, we can all have a kind of fun. Those two, no, 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 you must love one and hate the other. And I was just a McDonald's guy. I couldn't tell you the science behind it. Can't tell you the reason behind it. That's who I chose when I was a child, and that's who I will choose the rest of my life. And I will not go to Burger King. Matt Miller to- said McDonald's is the worst fast food restaurant. It is dog food. And then he said no Hardee's is good. Um, and then Damien said bring back old country buffet, damn it. Mar- uh, Typhon said margaritas all day. And Matt said I'm from Ohio. The only thing I can offer is Marion's Pizza. Hey, I love pizza. I'm Is there pizza fast food? I don't know that I'd like that. I don't, I don't think. I'm, I'm a little high maintenance about my pizza, too. <laughs> are you? Like, see, I'll, I'll order. Di- Man, I, look, when my wife's gone, I'll get Little Caesars all day. I'm $5 okay. high all right, no, hang on now. Hang on. A little Caesars is good. Okay. Uh, there you I'll go. Yeah. Caesars. See? But I'm not, my wife I'm not opposed so. to that. I, I, I won't eat Domino's at all. Uh, really? At all. That's at surprising. All. Won't do it. If I go to somebody's house and they have Domino's, I'll bring my own food. <laughs> I don't know. I listen. I can't explain. I'm a very conflicted person. Okay, I, I understand see. that about me, and I know that it makes my my family saints for putting up with me because I am a strange guy. Hey, you're, I have you're no picky. rhyme or reason as to how I got the way I got, but there I don't know. I, I just my wife. My wife likes Domino's. <laughs> we order Domino's in our house regularly, and I eat something else. I okay. That's totally fair. Totally fair. Uh, Michael said, can I get the fries from McDonald's and the burger from Burger King? Uh, that would be my choice if I could do it because I like the burger at Burger King a lot more. So, uh, Matt See, Miller, I don't. That thin patty with all that wide. See, it's not like Sonic's. It's totally different than Sonic's. It's just too much bread to meat combination. I want more meat, less bread. That's totally fair. That's where Wendy's would, uh, would come in. So That's right. Uh, that's Matt right. That's, said, a, that's right. It's not fast food. It's sit down. It's really good. He's talking about uh, Marion's pizza. Um, oh, okay. Let's see. Damien said Chicago pizza or New York pizza. Uh, I would go I'm Chicago. a Chicago guy. Yeah. All day long. Give me Gino's. I love give me, it. Give me, I, uh, I want a fork and a knife and a. Yeah. I want to be full when I'm done. I don't want to fold something and eat it on the street like an animal. Give me, give me Giordano's. I'm, I'm all about that. I will sit there and wait an hour for a pizza for that. No problem there. Um, let's see. Typhon said uh, Ponderosa. And then Matt Miller said the Mexican Coke is the best soft drink on planet Earth. I would agree. Oh, with in the that. glass bottle. Yeah, I'm in. I like. I love that stuff. We uh, we had that for my son's first uh, first birthday party, and it was fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Matt said, uh, "Just what I got to offer." We have no specialized fast food places up there. Uh, Typhon said, "Uno's Pizza and Wings," and then uh, Damien said, "McDonald's has the best sweet tea. Uh, it's too sweet for me. I I can't." Uh, we. Like, we we from the south. Yeah, it's not the same. We don't drink McDonald's sweet tea. No, unless you're overseas. It's, in which I case, mean, I I'll drink. You know. I'll drink it because I don't drink carbonation unless it's an al- has alcohol. It's just a it's just a rule. I have I have a lot of random rules, guys. Okay. <laughs> yes, you do. <laughs> but I don't Matt, I don't drink carbonation unless it's alcohol. So I will drink their tea, but I don't like their tea. McAllister's got great sweet tea, and uh, and Chick Fil A is in in awful. So Chick Fil A's is great. Uh, Matt All Miller, right, let's get out of here. We've Matt Miller said, uh, "BK has the minutes. worst chicken I've ever had." Yeah, that, I wouldn't. I wouldn't disagree with that. Uh, That's why you can get like twenty chicken nuggets from them for 
ninety nine cents. It's insane. Yeah, it's it's really insane. But that's because it's not it's, it's not really chicken. <laughs> uh, last question of the day. This right. one's for you, Chris. Uh, the Brown Yeti said, "What other crazy brands hill is Chris willing to die on?" I don't know. I know those those few. Those I know, but they come up in regular life when people say, why did you just make a big deal about that? I have to then let them into my little brain. Um, I don't really know. Just We, I, you we must can think, love one we can think about deal. this. I, I didn't plan on this becoming a fast food uh, conversation, but I'm glad it did. So, yeah. <laughs> I mean, this was actually a lot of fun. But uh, but no, we'll we'll talk about that, and we'll uh we'll have a a nice more organized conversation about this when we are a little more prepared for the topic. Um, the brown yeti said, "Welcome to eating cures everything." Yeah, you got. Oh, damn now, right. hang on. I will tell you. I'll tell right. you a brand thing. Now this this has morals behind it. Okay? okay, and what's what's really funny is now because of this, I immediately get accused of being forget about your politics for a minute. I get accused of being like a super right wing trumper. Like I don't wear anything with Nike at all, and Nikes don't come into my house at all, at all. That was what I'm a supporter of Colin Kaepernick. I I was one of the people we did a show the day after he took a knee, yep. and I said, "There's nothing more American than standing for the flag, other than kneeling, kneeling for the flag for the flag. Yep. Just your right to be able to do something without you know repercussions, I guess. In in certain so anyway, neither here nor there, but. I used to work as a contractor for Nike. And when I tell you that I was weighed and measured by my Nike manager and said, you don't fit the image here. And they wanted somebody who looked like a soldier and I don't look like a soldier and waited. Eh, they did that about a year and a half after I'd worked there and I'd fixed all the problems that they had and had it running like a clock. And then they basically said, we want somebody a lot smaller than you to be the manager here. Wow. And I went to my office, I cried my eyes out and I told my wife, I'm quitting my job. And I made a lot of money at that point in time. And I walked away and i walked away for half of that. But, but, anyway. but now you were doing significantly better. Oh yeah. So. No, it paid off. I bet on myself. That's it. That's I, a, I, and we got no problem job. with the, I learned how to do something. I became an expert in it. And then I started my own business. Yeah, Damien said Chris hates Michael Jordan. I see. Uh, I don't think you hate see. Michael that's Jordan. where the conflict comes in. I love Jordan, but I, yeah. I, but the brand I itself. I can love Jordan. I, I don't wear Nike anything. It doesn't come into my house. I, I, I love LSU. I buy off-brand LSU gear, non-licensed LSU gear, because they have a Nike check on everything now. Yeah, that's fine. Well, they certainly do. And I, that's, that's I, the way and college sports wear, is going. That's the way it's going. I have one polo. Either my wife or my mom got me many years ago. It's a very nice. That's the Ed Orgeron dress polo that he yeah, always the, the wears. Coach, the coach's deep, shirt. That deep purple. Yeah. I have that one from, oh, golly, that thing might be 10 years old. That's the only thing I didn't throw out and still every now and then will throw on. It makes sense. I totally understand it from uh, from that point of view. But they hurt my feelings emotionally. They scarred well, me. Yeah. So the hell with them. The hell with that? I, I totally get it. I totally get it. Joseph, uh, last comment, said, Chicago pizza is not pizza. It's just a bowl of cheese with some bread. And Damien said, it's still What's pizza. What's wrong with that? I, you got me. You got me. And Typhon, last one, Evan Williams with a splash of cola. Uh, I'll take that. Give me the green label. Give me the green label. Higher proof. All right. That's going to wrap up the show. You guys have been fantastic. We appreciate all of you for jumping in the comments. As always, you have helped drive the show, and we cannot thank you enough for doing that. Go over to winningcureseverything.com. That is our website. All of our picks, previews, podcasts, videos, and social media platforms are over there. Uh, what happened? Jaron Jackson, out for the season. Oh, good Lord. You've got to be kidding me. Meniscus tear. Son of a bitch. Well, the Grizzly season officially over. So, with that said, uh, we appreciate everybody watching. <laughs> that makes me sad. <laughs> what a terrible way to end the show. All right, so we're... Sad. We're going to go watch uh, some baseball and some basketball and some hockey and whatnot. We're going to have a good sports night. We're going to try not to think about the uh, the bad things going on with the Grizzlies and the bad things going on with the virus, etc. We are praying and hoping for a good football season. Uh, by the way, our prayers are with everybody over in Beirut because that was a horrific uh, explosion and whatnot that happened over there earlier. I mean, that was... Holy cow. That was massive. I mean, I don't even know where to begin with that, but... We, we don't know anything about it, so we ain't even going to talk about it. But 
prayers out to them and, and everybody affected by that because it looked bad, really bad. Uh, with that said, go over to sbrpicks.com, sportsbookreview.com. All of our college football content will be over there this season once everything gets rocking and rolling. We've already got several videos up over there. You can find them on our website, or you can find it over at sbrpicks.com or on their YouTube channel. So go and check it out. Do your thing. Make sure you subscribe to the show. All those wonderful things. Everybody, thank you so much. Share the show out. Take care of yourself.